Well, hello. So, what with Christmas time barreling towards us at a pretty alarming rate, like it's not long until Christmas now, really, we have, as we have for many years now, started a Christmas corner, which is exactly as it sounds. It's a corner in this here spare room, um, dedicated to stuff that we've already started buying each other and for other people for Christmas. Um, so yeah, that corner of stuff is growing, but we've got somewhat of an issue. So please excuse the mess, this will be tidied by the end of this vlog, somewhat. Here's the stuff that we're buying for Christmas, this is some Christmas stuff, but as you can see here there's a big old, a big old mountain of Star Wars The Black Series action figure boxes that were on this shelf, um, but because I've been juggling around stuff and I've put stuff up here on the walls like that you see these boxes have been relegated to the floor which is annoying because there's some really good action figures in there but at, at the moment at least we've not got much room upon these here shelves to display anything so I'm gonna put these into storage for now a couple of these action figures need to go back in boxes but I'm gonna put it into storage for now until we have an appropriate place that I can display everything. So that's today's task. We need to put everything in a bigger box. Maybe like, what, what's it called? You know, like a big Tupperware box. Not a Tupperware box. A bit, I'll show you. I've, I've bought something. That's the plan. I'm going to put it in a big box anyway. And then put that box in the attic for now. <sighs> this is what I've got. You see, a big box. Not, it's, like I said, it's, it's not Tupperware. It's just like a big... Um, a storage box, I guess is what we're going to call it. But, that's definitely big enough for like, all them things over there. So that's what we're going to do. We're going to put that stuff in here, that's step numero uno. Oh, while we're at this, we also want to take stock of the number of Star Wars The Black Series action figures that I've actually got at the moment, because I've, I'm sort of losing track. So we're going to count all the ones that go in the box, we're going to count the ones out on display here, and then we're going to count the ones that are already up in the attic, is the plan. That's a good plan. Okay, so in go the first three. Wait, how do I do this? Do I, do I stand them up or do I lay them flat? Hang on, come and look, come and look. Here's, here's the issue, right? Do I stand them up like this, which is all well and good, but if... If I get to like a second level, it's a little bit close to the lid. I feel like it's going to get squashed with the lid. Or, I think this could be the plan. We'll lay them down like so. One, two, three, another one there. Then however many you can get to fill it up to the top. I think that's going to be the plan. But, they've got numbers on the side, so I'm going to face those numbers out. So, at just a glance, I'll be able to see... I'll be able to see which ones I've got, you see? That's some good planning, me. So that one there. That one's turning upside down. Yes, it's all coming together. Okay, just to throw a spanner in the works, look at this oddly sized, oddly shaped Gin Urso box. Gin? Oh well, there's plenty of room, so you can go there for now. Looks good, that's like pretty much that corner done. Oopsie doodle, we missed two, we missed Luke Skywalker and Snoke. They've got to go in this box as well. One, two. Nailed it. Do you want another spanner in the works? Look at this tiny little thing. It is for the child. The child from the Mandalorian. Look, you can't even see it. It's that little and blurry. Look at him. That is the tiniest Black Series figure ever. Do we put him in the box or do we keep him out? He's adorable. I say we keep him out. My decision is final. Come on, Yoda. You're going back on the shelf. Let's see how many, how many actually fit on, how many more we can go, how many rows, how many rows we can add on until it gets too much. I th oh no, 
the box nearly fell off the chair. I think that's your maximum. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight, sixteen, twenty-four, thirty-two. Thirty-two can go in this box if, if you discount this damn big, oddly shaped one. But apart from that, thirty-two. By the way, one day I have every intention of getting all these Black Series action figures out again and displaying them in some way, shape or form somewhere. Maybe not here, I don't know, maybe this whole room needs a re-design, um, a re-fettle, a re-think. Um, but yeah, they're in the box. Now the box needs to go up there. Also, look how tidy this is right now. Okay, let's compare it to earlier. This, this like, well, this one Black Series box. In fact, put him, we'll put him there. Okay, that's just that one there is for the Imperial Probe Droid right there. Then we just got like the special, the special ones like the Galaxy's Edge ones, uh, Gaming Greats one. Uh, what's this one? It's a carbonized one. Also, this. I got this today, let me tell you about it. You will be forgiven for thinking that this was a comic book at first glance because, to be honest, this is an edition of a comic book. The cover of this box is the cover of a comic book. But within this box is a special Star Wars The Black Series exclusive action figure from um, somewhere. I don't know where. I don't know where. Let me show you anyway. Okay, so let's crack it open. And look inside here, let's just open that up properly. There is no action figure, I'll tell you why, I've already got it out. It's this Luke Skywalker action figure, which is in fact the same Luke as on the cover. See, look at that, but within this box is all like his Jedi training stuff. You know, like from A New Hope, he's got his little blast helmet there. He's got the probe droid that shoots at him. He's got a gun, which is quite hard to see. He had the lightsaber in there, but that's in his hand. He's got some, like, sacred Jedi texts down here. This is a good, a good action figure. It's a good package. It's a nice, nice package. I got this for a steal. This was, like, £16 all in. I've seen this going for, like, two or three times that price, so I'm pretty happy with that. It looks good. It is a fine addition to the collection. It's also staying down here on the shelf right right there. Back you go. Back you go in there. Right next to the child's box. Look how small it look how small he is. Adorable. So now let's talk numbers. In this box we have got 15 Star Wars the Black Series action figures. All stowed away in here nice and safe. So 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, then 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35 and a half. We're going to count as one. 36 and then down here 37. So that's what we've got to remember. We've got 37 Star Wars The Black Series action figures down here so far at the minute. Next step is we've got to go up, up, up there. Wrestle the box up into the attic. Go put it somewhere appropriate and neat. And we also need to count the rest of the action figures too. So let's get this done. Good. Uh, okay, so, next step. How many did we have? 37? It was 37, wasn't it? 37. 37 Black Series action figures downstairs and in this box. So we need to remember 37. But then, in this box, in the box for Ray's speeder, which also counts the figure, so 38. 38 with Ray Speeder. We've got a couple more hidden away in here. 39, 40, so 40. In fact, I'm going to put the big box in there because it fits and it pleases me. So we're still at 40.
And then there's another box here that I have handily labelled Black Series Figs. I don't know if you can see that, but that's what it says. So, we're going to add these figures into that box because this is just a cardboard box. No one likes cardboard boxes, right? So, 40, 41, 42, 48, 49, and some tiny pogs. Tiny pogs. 50. Now I don't know about you but 50 is a lovely round number to remember. So we got 50 downstairs and in this here box. 50. But hold your horses before you get excited. This box contains another 17 Star Wars The Black Series action figures. So 50 add 17 is 67. This box has another 16 which takes us to 83 and this box has another 20 in it which takes us to 103. 103 Star Wars The Black Series action figures and that's before any more of my pre-orders have turned up. That's ridiculous. Let's tidy them up for now. Make sure it all looks neat and tidy. Looking good. Race speeder on top, and we all lived happily ever after. Look, we've got a snow trooper down there, and then we've got up here, we've got General Leia Organa. Wow. I, I actually didn't realise how many action figures I got, and now I do. Look at the pogs. Look at the pogs. Oh. So, there you go, there's me rounding up a lot of the Star Wars, the Black Series action figures that I've got so far. It turns out I've got more than I thought I did. I don't know why I'm surprised, I keep ordering them. The numbers are only going to go up. Like, that's basic maths. If you, if you buy more than you sell, the number goes up. Whatever, I didn't think about that. Christmas corner's clear now, or clear enough to start gathering presents, to collate them, to send them to Santa, to be gifted at Christmas, so... I'd say that the job is a good one. If you enjoyed this vlog, please give it a thumbs up and a subscribe if you're not already. And with that being said, I'm going to get going. So, I'll see you guys... ...next time. Oh, damn it. I, I needed to do the thing. Yeah.